there's an irony that when documenting London's bustling ceremonial past, it's done in such silence and a twinge of sadness that for years much of this was out of sight collecting dust in an archive, but not anymore. This is the new Collage website which has a quarter of a million images from our collections at London Metropolitan Archives and Guildhall Art Gallery available digitally at the click of a mouse. In other words, London's past is now readily available, a photograph album of the capital. One of the most exciting elements of the new website is the London picture map. It allows you to zoom in and see any address in central or outer London as well. For instance, if you look in at Tower Bridge, you'll be able to see all of the photographs, prints and film footage as well. So the photos you'll see include some of those which were taken while it was being constructed. And I think they provide quite an astonishing view. Changed quite a bit around here, Lawrence. Absolutely, all of those wharves and warehouse buildings which you can see have gone now. But the city itself has changed a lot and you can see glass and steel behind there in the, in the city buildings. I think though that Tower Bridge still really dominates the skyline, it really is a fantastic building. The depth of the website is fascinating. Many pictures not seen for decades. Some forgotten photographic negatives, like this one. Only when it was printed did it reveal what had been lost. But it's not just about the tourist hotspots. This is Peckham in 1804. St Mary's College. It's now a Morrison's car park. Where do you think that was? Or is? It is. Oh wow. Exactly. What does it look like? This is look like uh, um... Oh dear. Have a guess. Um, <laughs> looks like the countryside. Shall I tell you? Yes, yeah, sure. It's right here. You're standing where it was. But the but this house, what is about? It's all gone. I should think it's somewhere in this country or western part of Europe. I should say it's in Peckham. That's because you just read it there. But fast forward from Southwark's pastoral scene to its slums and poverty a few decades later. Each picture moving on the capital's story. Back at the archive, the search is on for the next batch, bringing the past back to life for an eternity online. Jim Weeble, BBC London News.